Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel Tech and Tips with King. In this video, I am going to show how you can run Ubuntu in your Android with using Limo PC Emulator application. So let's get into the video. In this video, I am going to show how you can run Ubuntu in your Android phone with using Limo PC Emulator application. So before starting the video, let me just give you a quick brief about the ubuntu uh, basically ubuntu is a operating system os uh, based on linux and there are a lot of lot of os based on linux like uh, parrot os uh, uh, kali linux anonymous os and there are a lot of lot of os uh, based on linux and while using it's the same like windows uh, while in the there the linux are the open source uh, OS where you can do a lot of things so basically it's an operating system where you can uh, use like a P Windows PC uh, the operating system is supported by the PC so in this video I'm going to show how you can run uh, that uh, operating system the base Ubuntu based on Linux in your Android and I have already made a lot of lot of videos on my YouTube channel in that uh, you videos I have shown how you can run the different different uh, types of uh, Linux like Parrot OS, um, uh, Kali Linux, Anonymous OS, uh, Ubuntu this is the another version I have made a, already made a video on Ubuntu and this is the another another version the latest version of the Ubuntu I am showing in this video there are a lot of features and a lot of things you can do in the ubuntu so in this video i'm going to show how you can run ubuntu operating system in your android phone with using limbo pc emulator application so i have done with the uh, brief explanation about the ubuntu and i am going to give a quick uh, overview and brief of the limbo pc emulator application so as you can see this is my android phone and in this android phone i have installed limbo pc emulator application so basically this is the application for android it's not officially available on the play store but i provide the downloading in the description you can check out the download from there so as you can see this is the limbo basically this is the android application and this is the emulator application while using this application you can run any type of operating system like windows and linux and android os also any operating system which can possibly run in machine you can uh, run in this software with using limbo pc emulator application and the limbo pc is uh, different different for the different different mobile phones uh, depend on your uh, android smartphone and the processor make sure you know what the, you have knowledge about this so as you can see i'm using the latest version of the limbo pc emulator application and uh, as i mentioned earlier this is the uh, latest version of the limbo pc emulator application i've downloaded and installed in my android phone after downloading and installing limbo pc emulator in your android phone next thing you have to do is the download you want to file the downloading in the description after downloading it will look like this as you can see it will be approx 700 mb make sure you have enough data to download this so as you can see this is the ubuntu 10.0.1 zip version uh, this will be in the zip file and i've provided the download drive link first of all i have uh, provided the telegram channel link uh, in the description from the description you can get into the telegram channel uh, official channel of mine so from that you can get the link of this ubuntu and i have uh, provided the short link so it will be help for my youtube channel to get some revenue so after bypassing the shortener link you will get the google drive link of this ubuntu after downloading you have to extract it as you can see after extracting it will be uh, in the vsd file and it will get about uh, 3 gp so make sure you have enough storage in your android phone after extracting so before extracting it will be approx 700 mb and after extracting it will get about uh, 3 gb as you can see in the screen this is the vsd file which we are going to run in android phone so now after uh, downloading and installing the limbo pc emulator application and after downloading the ubuntu file you have to open the limbo pc emulator application and before you have to open make sure you have connected with the internet uh, mobile data or wi-fi i have connected with my wi-fi wi-fi because uh, the ubuntu is going to connect the inter internet so internet going to work in this ubuntu so let me just open the limbo pc emulator application now you have to click on the none you have to click on the one you can create the machine so i've already created the machine so let me just show you so this is the ubuntu so let me just show you all the settings which i have done you can do easily first of all you have to create the machine after creating you have to get into the board you have to skip the user interface you have to get into the board 
and in CPU model you have to collect the select the code to do in the CPU model you have to select the code to do and you have to scroll down you have to get into the CPU codes you have to select four and RAM will be depend on your smartphone specifications so I have uh, uh, enough RAM to run this uh, Ubuntu with the 2 GB of RAM as you can see this is the 2000 MB which means 2 GB so it will going to perfectly work so if you have uh, more enough RAM in your Android phone you can select more so I've selected the 2 GB is more than enough for this Ubuntu now you have to select the enable MTTCG and you have to uncheck the disable TSC so this is the settings you have to do in the board now you have to scroll down you have to get into the disk disk you have to select the disk a you have to select the uh, ubuntu file which you have downloaded and kept in the android internal storage you have to select that file in the disk now you have to scroll down you have to get into the network as i mentioned earlier this uh, ubuntu is going to support it by the internet so we have to select the network card in the network you have to select the uh, user in the network card you have to select rtl 8139 this is the network card you have to select and you have to so we have done all the settings in the limbo pcm router application now you have to just click on the play button so before clicking play button let me just uh, turn on the internet so before let me just uh, before let me turn the android phone let me just um, turn on the screen rotation so as you can see I have just now have turn on the screen rotation. Now you have to turn the Android phone. So I have turned on the Android phone. So get you can get the better view for better understanding. So let me just set up the camera and come back again. So as you can see in the screen, I have turned my Android phone. Now I'm going to just click on the play button. I have done all the settings in the Limo PC simulator and I have enabled the internet. Now I'm going to just click to play button. And it will sing booting from hard disk. So it means the ubuntu file has been successfully supported by this limbo pc letter application if you're getting an error that might be problem in the file so you have to check whether it's working with the limbo pc emulator or not so here you have to wait because the ubuntu is booting up here it will go into few movements so as you can see it will start at uh, booting up So as you can see in the screen, finally the Ubuntu has been successfully booted in my Android phone with using Limbo PC Emulator application. So as you can see, this is the Limbo PC Emulator application status bar. So let me just hide it. And now as you can see, this is the mouse cursor. So let me just take the phone near to the camera so you can understand. So as you can see, this is the Ubuntu and as you can see the time and date has been successfully synced with this. This is the shutdown button. And this is the keyboard then as you can see as i mentioned earlier this is the internet this ubuntu is supported by the internet as you can see it will showing the internet has been connected while using volume up and down button you can get the more options of the desktop as you can see like this create folder create launcher a lot of things you can do and the good thing this is uh the ubuntu is in, in the english language so let me just uh, show you the applications there are a lot of preloaded uh, applications in the ubuntu the good thing of this ubuntu is there are a lot of preloaded applications you don't need to require to install let me just show you as you can see accessories calculator cd drive creator disk management so let me just get into the games so as you can see this is the games they have provided preloaded graphics so this is the uh, graphics software they have provided internet and this is the all the internet and the firefox officially browser has been uh, provided in this the office so as you can see this is the all the office software has been provided sound and video movie player as you can see sound recorder so this is the software center where you can download more free software as you can see let you choose the thousands of free applications so as you can see in the screen there are a lot of uh, free thousands of free application available for the Ubuntu you can download and the internet is perfectly working so you can download and you can use it so as you can see this is the place system preference about me so let me just click to about me
so as you can see in the screen uh, the preference about my appearance you can uh, do some changes or settings uh, about this uh, ubuntu preference administration as you can see this is all the so let me just show you about this uh, ubuntu about ubuntu by clicking on it so as you can see this is the about the ubuntu they have shown so let me just close this so while comparing to windows and ubuntu ubuntu is perfectly to work so uh, you can make your android phone into a pc because uh, ubuntu is perfectly working there are a lot of lot of uh, softwares available for the ubuntu and it's better to uh, use ubuntu while comparing to windows because it's have all the softwares while comparing to windows so now i am going to open the firefox let's test whether the internet is perfectly working or not as I mentioned earlier, I have selected the network card in the Limbo PC Emulator application settings. Now I am going to open the Firefox browser to test the internet is working or not. So just now if click on the Fire Mozilla Firefox and automatically it's have oh, so it's detected detect the internet. So this is the previous search where I have searched. So let me just open the new tab. So just now I've opened the new tab. Now let me just type in the search bar www.google.com. So this is the very good thing. Let me just tell you about this uh, limbo and the Ubuntu. This is the tab I have left a few hours and it's still uh, it here like a real pc so this is the very good thing to use so that's why i'm recommending to use a limbo pc emulator with any operating system so you can make your android phone a portable pc so as you can see the internet is perfectly working the google search engine has been opened so let me just search anything in the search engine to test whether the search engine is working or not the internet is working or not perfectly so as you can see just now select a search hello and it will showing all the search results related to hello as you can see in the screen if you're having a physical keyboard and mouse you can use it as you can see while clicking on here as you can see external mouse desktop so in my upcoming video i try to show how you can do that for now I am going to show you with this so as you can see in the screen this is the all the search tutorials they have showing so let me just open the Wikipedia website to show you the Mozilla Firefox is perfectly working or not So as you can see this is the all the search results have showing in Google it means the internet is perfectly working uh, you can download any other browser it's up to you you can also install chromium which is perfectly working in the linux you can install it as i mentioned earlier you can download and install many softwares in the ubuntu there are thousands of software available so as you can see in the screen this is the ubuntu perfectly uh, running in android and the internet is also perfectly working so as you can see in the screen this is the ubuntu has been operating system perfectly working in android with using limo pc emulator application so that's it for this video thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel like this video share this video if you have a problem let me know in the comments thank you